everyone, this is Zach. And Rachel. And we're here from Safety Gear Pro, and we're gonna be talking about the Ray-Ban sunglass frames. So now, Rachel, how long has Ray-Ban been around for? Wow, uh, Ray-Ban's been around since the 1950s. I yeah. Mean, yeah, this is a, a sunglass, uh, a pair of sunglasses <laughs> that has stood the test of time. Yeah, I feel like kind of Ray-Ban recently has kind of modernized the fashion sunglass sense. So it's like they kind of took the fashion sunglasses and then they upgraded it and made it their own kind of style. Do you kind of, how do you feel about that? Yeah, I, I mean, that sounds pretty accurate. It's like, you know, we see these frames pop up in the 50s and then you know they kind of died down in the 1970s but then here come the 80s and we get our wayfair style sunglasses yeah. right here yeah i've seen a lot of 80s movies and i've seen this style in almost all of them right yes yeah. i know these are just totally classic and fun so i'm going to put them on just so you can see perfect right? you look great on you but you know what they also look good on zach oh <laughs> don't mind me yeah, so I do like this style. It's a little bit small for me, mm -hmm. but I feel like this is perfect for someone with a little bit of a sleeker face. Like I kind of have a wider face and I just think like if people were to get these, it's, what amazes me also is this lightweight. It's not that yes. heavy on your face because you would think like it looks a little blocky and you, you would think, oh, that might be a little heavy, but it's not. With this lightweight technology, this is more of a nylon based frame. So with Ray-Ban, it's all their stuff is lightweight and it's all made around comfort. Yeah, I would agree with that when I put it on, even though like it has a little bit of a wider feel like in the, the temple and the frame itself, it yes. is very lightweight and very like comfortable against my head. Yeah, no, that's perfect. Yeah, I think that one's a very nice shape, right? We just said it's basically a classic, mm -hmm. but then we have sort of the upgrade or maybe the new version of that right here called our uh, Clubmaster. Oh, okay. And see, I've seen this style as well yes. in 80s movies. <laughs> 80s movies, I, I think we're just stuck in the 80s here today. So <laughs> if you look at this frame in comparison to this, I'll just kind of hold it up for a yeah, few while, Zach, you can see it. So you can see that they kept this really pronounced brow line, but what they did is they kind of chopped or slimmed the rim down here and made this really sleek style. Um, I would say like when we're wearing it, we just talked about how this was a little bit more lightweight and comfortable. This yeah. is also lightweight, but because these have glass um, lenses, it has just like a little bit more weight. It's not uncomfortable. And in fact, it's actually kind of like nice. Like, you know, the sunglasses are on your face. Right. No. And that's something that a lot of people see. And like with, with me, we were just talking about this off camera. One thing that I like is having the having the sunglass kind of rest on your cheekbone mm, yes. and kind of giving you that coverage. I feel like with these, they don't. However, it does depend on the face structure and everyone's different. But one thing I've noticed about these, the Clubmaster, it comes with these little airbags, so uh, for nose pads. So it's like you get a little extra comfort with that. Even though these glasses might be a little bit heavier, you get extra comfort points with these, no, with these um, airbags. Can you feel these? They're comfy. Yeah, I mean, just right now when they were on my nose, I, I like that because almost all nose pads can be adjusted a little bit, right? Mm -hmm. So, I mean, if you have sort of a nose bridge that's hard to find the right pair of sunglasses that doesn't slip down for you or kind of pushes up too far, these types of glasses are perfect because you can always just adjust them and they fit your face perfectly. Exactly. And with the Wayfair, you don't really have that. But again, this is just a classic. This was the style back then and they're still bringing this style here. Now they do have different variations of the Wayfair, which we're going to talk about in a different video. But for right now, these Wayfairs, they're still comfy. But if you want that little extra support on your nose bridge, go with the Clubmaster. Okay, so since we're still kind of stuck in the 80s, one of my favorite movies, Top Gun. Um, now, I remember seeing Tom Cruise, Rock the Aviators. Now, again, this is some, uh, this is very popular amongst pilots and everything. As you can see here, this is a little bit more form-fitting in my face. So it's a little bit for bigger sunglasses, bigger frame kind of deal, but they also make women's. Yes, so here we have the uh, cockpit mm -hmm. aviators. And what I like is they're essentially the same exact style, right? Right. But like if Zach and I were to switch just for funsies sure. and I put this on, you can tell immediately 
like when I put these on as as a girl, like I think it's this temple here, Zach. What is this made out of? Oh, that's a carbon fiber temple. So yeah, it feels. It's very lightweight. Yeah, and and that's not a bad thing. But when I put it on, it's like okay, this is nice. It fits my face. It's it's easy to put on. When I grab these ones here, yeah. the material or this is kind of like a it's like a rubber, rubber. kind of nylon plastic yeah hard plastic this just feels super sleek so i really like that part of these aviators yeah and they're still lightweight because the temple's not super thick like exactly. this one's kind of thick mm -hmm. but with with yours they look a little more form-fitting and they and they look kind of stylish like that's something you would wear when you're like what a restaurant outside trying to impress your yes. friends and stuff like this and one major key difference you can see in these frames i know we're talking about the frames but this we're going to talk about the lenses for a second if you look at ray-ban you will see up here it says ray-ban but if it says ray-ban p then that means those are polarized with ray-ban's chromance technology so with Ray-Ban's Chromance technology, it's their form of polarization. So it's like they make colors pop, stand out. If you're running outside or if you're doing a lot of things, you will not be, your vision won't be blurred. And we'll talk about the UV rays. We can talk about more in-depth polarized lenses in this video here. So again, I think the Ray-Ban Aviators is a classic, clean and classic style for everyone. So now these frames are kind of, let's just say they're weird. They're, they're very different. Yes, they are very different. It's something that it's, uh, it, these are frames that you don't really see a whole lot of. So I'm gonna give Rachel these round frames Ooh, and then I'm gonna take, yes, I'm gonna say this correctly, hexagonal frames. So it is a hexagon on your face. Now, as you can see here, this is not my style. You guys have seen me in videos. Well, I mean, we can ask them. I don't think this is my style. <laughs> if you think this is my style, leave a comment down below. So, but with these glasses, it's kind of, it brings like a European kind of style and it's, it gives it more, what would you say? It's like, I don't know. It, it gives you the sense of like high fashion. I mean, not that I'm like an expert on high fashion, but I feel like you would see a girl like on a magazine wearing these types of sunglasses, you know, like yeah. they're just very sleek and they look, I don't know, even maybe a little bit like professional, like if I was traveling around the world and I wanted to take pictures of myself, I would choose something that looks a little bit unique. Yeah, and those frames, see when I see those frames, it reminds me of the Beatles, like John Lennon there frames. Mm -hmm. I think that's something he would wear. And then with these hexagonal frames, again, it's just a unique, fun and fashionable kind of sense. It's like, you know, it's it, it, like what you said, it's kind of high fashion and it's something that you don't see every day. And I think that's what Ray-Ban is going for. They want to go for unique and fashionable. So now we've talking about Ray-Ban and how they're fashionable sunglasses, mm -hmm. right? But Ray-Ban does make some kind of sporty frames. So now I'm not saying you can wear these like on, when you're playing baseball or softball or anything like that. But what I am saying is if you want to go for more of an active style, these frames here are perfect. It's this little double bridge frame. However, they do have this like little flexible temple that can oh, flex yeah. to your face and it can flex to your head and it adds a little extra comfort. So again, the reason why these are sportier is because of the comfort level. So again, when you're being active and you want to do a lot of stuff, you want comfort. And so for example, like I'm pretty sure Phil Mickelson, I want to say, wore a style like this or wears a style like this. He loves the double bridge look and again, he just wants comfort because again, these are very comfortable on my face that if I'm wearing a hat or something like that, like let's say I'm just walking around town or something, I could see myself wearing these frames. Again, it's a little bit too small, but I do love the temples on these. Yeah, I think they actually look very fashionable on you. Oh, so thank, that's a plus. thank you. All right, everyone. So these were the sunglass frames that we wanted to talk about today. If you guys need a prescription for your glasses, we can totally put prescription lenses in all of these frames here. Including the hexagonal one. Even the hexagonal one. Yeah, our labs can match the, we talked about the Chromance technology earlier. Our labs can match the Ray-Ban Chromance technology, which I think is a cool feature. Yeah, absolutely. And it's, you're not breaking the bank or anything like that. Our RX options are very reasonable price. 
very affordable. Yes, exactly. So what we're gonna do is leave you guys a link down below to our Safety Gear Pro website, um, and it'll be the Ray-Ban page. So if you're interested in any of these frames, you can go get some more information there. Yeah, and if you wanna learn more about Safety Gear Pro, and if you like this video, go ahead and leave a comment, give us a thumbs up, and hit that subscribe button, and even that little bell next to the subscribe button, so that you know every time Safety Gear Pro posts a new video. And if you wanna learn more about us, go ahead and just visit our website at safetygearpro.com, or if you wanna get in contact with us, go ahead and send us an email at sales at safetygearpro.com.